Stuff nerds, welcome back to my channel, guys. <laughs> I'm actually so excited for today's video. As you guys saw by the title, we'll be doing a bunch of bookish things. You guys love this video. I love doing this video. Um, honestly, it's just like a mosh posh of random bookish things. Um, <laughs> today we won't be doing a haul, so if you're here for that, I'm gonna warn you so that you can jump ship if you want to. I understand. I know a lot of people expect hauls in this in these videos, but I've had <laughs> I have plenty of books on my TBR cart. Um, so the kind of plan for this video is we are gonna wrap a bunch of books. I also just got a Kindle. So we're gonna like set it up, play around with it, um, add some stickers to the back. I also have stickers on my iPad, um, but because I wanna like, obviously got in my Kindle, we're gonna switch them around. So we'll have stickers for my iPad and my Kindle. Don't know why I need to specify that, but I got a lot of stickers, so that's fine. Um, we are gonna unhaul a few books. Um, I'm just tired of seeing them on my shelves and I think I just need to get them out. Um, and yeah, honestly, um, we'll throw in a couple random things. I'm going to add two. We are going to be reading a book together, but I'll explain what the juicy tea is with that. First, if you guys like <laughs> bookish things vlogs, if you guys like all the nerdy things, then definitely give this video a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button without further ado. Let's just get started. So um, throughout this video, you'll probably see a couple of clips of me reading a book. Um, so this book I read <laughs> was actually supposed to be in a, another reading vlog, um, but it's just not going to, it's not going to happen. Um, and so I didn't want to not put this book in the reading vlog, read, reading vlog number one. Um, and so I really want you guys to see my reaction because I honestly, genuinely, I don't know. It's a, <laughs> it's interesting reaction response. And it was just an interesting overall book because I've never talked about the series on my channel before. So I don't want to tell you too much. I just want you guys to go in there knowing that like this clip was meant for another video. So if I say stupid stuff or random stuff, um, or things that don't match <laughs> with like this video, that's why. Um, but anyway, so, um, I don't know when I'm going to wrap the books, whatever, but I really want to set up my Kindle. So we're going to go, um, do that. Yeah. So good. <laughs> So, <laughs> um, we got my Kindle, we have a stuff. I just got the, like, um, cheapest one. I honestly was like, I don't know how I, f like, I didn't know how I was gonna feel about it. Um, I was thinking of getting the paperweight, because I know a lot of people have that one. Um, but I was like, honestly, if this does the same things, which I was doing a, like, digging into it a lot, and honestly, I think the biggest difference was, like, the lights in it, and I was like, honestly, I don't even care that much, like, whatever it was was insignificant enough that I was like, okay, whatever, we'll go with the cheapest one, because all I need to do is read, genuinely, don't need really much else, so, we want that one, and then I was like, if, honestly, if I feel like I need, like, a more upgraded one, or if I'm missing something, like, um, specifically, I can always ask for one for Christmas, or, like, you know what I mean, like, sell this one, get it, like, there were ways that I was like I'm not gonna be stuck with this for the rest of my life you know what I'm saying so we got that I also knew I wanted a pop socket just because I have one like on my phone and it is my favorite thing in the whole wide world um, and so this one I put on way too high I would have put it like lower but anyway um, so I knew I want a pop socket I also have heard people who <sighs> There's always the debate on which side you put the pop socket on because you could put it like right in the middle But sometimes that's like awkward. So if you put it on like one side, but then they were like whatever So we were I was debating on whether I wanted like one or two But I was like, let's just get like a cute set of like more neutral ones like ones that are not like crazy designs So because depending on the stickers, it's gonna be a lot, you know what I'm saying? Um, so there's that this was also had the stickers in it sorry here's my ipad just because obviously it's empty now i took all the stickers out so i made a couple different like <laughs> of piles here 
So this one's honestly, it's really full, but these are a lot of the ones that are like, I'm okay not putting on any of these like currently. Um, some of them are cute. Some of them are things that like, I don't like are not my favorites. So like there are cats in here. Like I don't care about cats on my stuff. Sorry, not sorry. And then we have this stack here, which is um, seasonal. So we have, it's definitely fall. You see like um, the ghost is obviously like October, um, but I'm honestly so excited. So this will probably end up being all the stickers on like my, um, fall, <laughs> um, November, uh, October, November, like, thing, because it has, like, th this is freaking so cute. It's Harry Potter stuff, but, like, obviously, tis not the season, and then we have, like, book spice and everything nice, like, so cute, but, like, waiting for fall, you know? So those two can go to the side. Then we have... This bag was stuff that I liked, that I could use if I need like space, or because some of these are smaller, obviously some of these are really big, but some of them are smaller, um, some of them are ones like, um, you know, are cute, but like I don't need to put on my stickers, like it was like whatever. Um, I didn't tell you, I also bought, like I bought two different packs on Amazon, um, because there was a couple like promo uh, stickers that I was like oh my gosh I need those so um, that's kind of why I like have so many um, and I was like honestly I could just change them out and again I have my iPad and my Kindle so that's why I got so many but I, I split them up earlier because I knew it would take forever and then this one is like ones that I, I would really like to get on my Kindle but obviously there's only so much space you know on either one um, so just depending on kind of what we have going on um, <laughs> I would really like to get a lot of these on but obviously that's way too many so there's that and then this one is like non-negotiables like I really will try my best to get these on my <laughs> Kindle and my iPad so obviously there's like a lot in here so it probably will end up just being these but we have to play around with like size and stuff because obviously like um something skinnier may work you know what I'm saying and then I also don't want it to just be like um words um we have some like cute little animals in here I love him so much he was a non-negotiable um so we're gonna play around with this I'm just gonna you know kind of speed through it because I need to turn my AC on and it's hot so we're gonna figure this out together and um yeah sit back relax enjoy
currently trying not to get so annoyed. It's so freaking cute, but this sticker won't stay right here. And then I also had the book dragon one that was there. So I changed around a little bit because thinking that, oh, like, let me just take the sticker off. No, no sticker wants to stay there. And I don't want to like stick it down, but I might have to. Um, this one moves a little bit too. Like it's so annoying though, cause it's just like the randomest stickers. So I don't know what I'm gonna do for now. Like I don't wanna obviously stick them cause I'm not gonna keep this for like, like this for very long. And I do know, like unfortunately I have to put a pop socket on it. So he's gonna go probably right over Mr. Man here. But I just think this is so cute. Obviously you saw that was like took forever. And I honestly, <sighs> oh gosh, it's gonna piss me off. Okay, right, that's a little better. You can see, see this one moves and I didn't tape it down. But also this case is like horrible to take off. So like, we're just gonna leave it like this for a little bit longer. Cause honestly, we're gonna get into like fall soon enough that this, I freaking love this though. I do love like the thick thighs and book of vibes. I, that, I died. The little otter so cute. We have so many options for like little cute things. And then there are a bunch of options also for like the book and stuff. You can see the freaking tape, it's fine. And then obviously all the cute stuff and then my, Throwing up glasses is my current obsession, so of course we have to do it again. It's all gonna change. I'll be like super like um relative to what I'm like in love with at the moment. So that's why I was so excited about all the options though. Um I'll probably just do my iPad and then show you it because that took way too long for me to like actually put in any time and effort again. Um so I'm thinking, what am I thinking? That is way too high, I think. Okay, so I kind of went almost center, but I wanted it closer to this side because I know I'll be reading with this hand mostly. Um, I'm like, that does not feel comfortable to me. So like, I'm, I don't know, I'm feeling like a, this kind of situation, which is also kind of weird. But I also noticed like the pop socket on my phone is from the pop sockets brand. Um, so they have a different, it has definitely a different like grip to it. So this feels like normal, especially too, because it's in the middle here. Um, so I, just, I think it's going to take some getting used to, but again, oh my gosh, look at all this chaos. I hate my life. <laughs> I'm just not going to do it right now. We're going to have to come back to it. Um, but I think this is a good, what we're, we're going with here. So we're going to have to figure this out and then I'll come back to you and when it's all freaking done. Um, but yes. I need to do something else though before I like get pissed off. <laughs> I just wanted to update you guys because I got halfway with Indigo Ridge. Um, I'm on chapter 13, uh, page 171. I'm freaking obsessed. I'm kind of loving this. I'm loving this like mystery romance thing that we have going on. Um, I hope we get the answer in this one, but I don't know if it's something that like drags on between all the other books. I don't, that would be stupid though because I don't think it's the same main characters. So I'm excited to like find out and figure it out. You know what I mean? So I'm enjoying this a lot. And then um, it's going by super quick. I literally have like um, a little under two hours left. And yeah, like basically it's hour 58 minutes. So basically two hours left. I'm like, I feel like this is going by super quick. It's very entertaining. I don't want to stop listening to it. Um, I did listen, get it on Audible. I think you guys saw that. So I have some suspicions. Um, but obviously we don't even know for sure. <laughs> we obviously won't know until the ending, so we'll see, but, um, I'm loving this. Yeah? Yeah.
else? I never got to update you um, after I finished this freaking book last night. I'm obsessed in love. I genuinely, if I didn't already um, start wrapping some of my books for my TBR next month, I probably would have started the next book in this series because I ate this up. It was so good in the next book. It's single parent trope, so it's giving. <laughs> I'm screaming. <laughs> maybe I'll have to end up doing like a single parent. Oh my gosh, maybe I'll be, I'll read, maybe I'll get all the single parent books in next month's TBR and then read them all together. I don't know. I mean, in a vlog. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, though, this book, I loved it. I thought it was the perfect amount of like romance to like mystery ratio. Um, I thought like the ending was great. You were in it. You're like, oh my gosh, what's gonna happen? I love, 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 love like the Eden, Eden family. I love like their, all the siblings are super close and so I love that. Um, and there's just so much I love about this book. I'm not gonna lie to you. I get, had to go with five freaking stars. Um, I honestly like, this is one I could like see myself reading again just because it was so enjoyable. Um, and I still, literally, I did not guess what was gonna go down. I did not guess what was gonna go down, y'all. I said, ah, shook it, shook it to the core. Um, but I enjoyed every minute of it. And if you have any recommendations, that's kind of like this book, where again, there's a little bit of mystery. But let me tell you, like, I do not like being scared. So if there's, if it's like, if it's like slightly, um. If it's like this, where it's like not really scary, like I could get jumpy, but like it's not really scary, um, then I'm all in for it. So if you have recommendations that's like this book, where it's like mystery, with, honestly I would prefer it to have like romance um, in it, romance mystery in it, because I enjoyed that. Um, but like, I don't also, like I loved the Natural series, but um, I don't want to read like the YA versions of mystery, like, like, things I feel like it's stupid. So if you have something like this, let me know down below because that would be really great. <laughs> All right, so I just wanted to give a couple um, oh, updates. I'll grab my um, Kindle, my iPad in a second, because oh, I have my iPad, I'll grab my Kindle in a second, but um, I wanted to say a few things. One, um, so obviously, like, I don't know if you're probably like, why did you turn the paper inside out? It was because I was using like almost, I don't wanna say leftover, but like uh, rolls of paper that wouldn't have been enough for all of the books. And I definitely did not wanna go buy a freaking roll of paper just to put it on the books. <laughs> so I was like, I'm just gonna use what we have. I had one from like a baby shower too. And so I was like, it would be so weird. Even if like, you know, some of them were like happy birthday and other ones were designed. It would be so weird to be like, have the baby shower one. <laughs> and so I was like, I'm just gonna turn them inside out. It ended up being that some of them are different colors anyway. Like the, whatever, different. Don't, don't judge me. <laughs> um, this is a hot mess. So we do have some cute ones that I did the other day with this paper but like that paper ran out and so it was like whatever. Um, so anyway, <laughs> that's why I'm flipping it inside out. But um, I think I wrapped 30 books, so I'm so excited for um, my TBR. It's gonna be a good one. Um, but 
Yes, if you're like, what the heck, Marissa? I just wanted to tell you that. Um, also, I want to tell you the three books that I am unhauling. I don't love to unhaul because there is like the sense of what if I'm in the mood for it in the future. But I think I have to come to grips with terms with the fact that like I can just repurchase the book. And as much as that's stupid, it's like I don't, if I actually miss it, then I'll repurchase it. But I've never actually missed a book so. When I just did my unhaul, I did it a, a little while ago. I can't even remember what books were in there because they were so like, I don't want to say irrelevant, but like irrelevant in my head. And I know that like these are books that um, some of these are people really like. Um, and so it's just going to be, it's just going to be a hard, a hard pill to swallow. <laughs> um, but first we do have One Dark Window by Rachel Gillig. I just have, I just, I just think the gothic energy, the gothic vibe is not my vibe. <laughs> and normally, like, again, there's so plenty of books that I read that are like dark romance or things that you would not catch me doing in real life. Like, let's be so for real. Like, of course, obviously. But I think with this book specifically, it's just like something about like it being inside of her and then like the tarot card, whatever it's called. Like, that whole vibe to me, it's just not my vibe. It's not like, um,. It's not interesting. <laughs> it's not, um, yeah, I just don't want to read it genuinely. And so I'm like, as much as the story may be good or whatever, I just don't want to force myself. It's just not my, it's not my vibe. Um, and so, I don't know. Like, it's like a gothic version of like maybe Carval-esque. Because I know Carval has like the cards and stuff, um, which that was interesting. But like, that, this is way more like gothic and, and... I don't know just not my vibe so I don't want to force myself and then like hate it so I rather just make it on the list of never gonna read it's fine <laughs> and this one for now is on Kindle Unlimited but if it ever comes out again I can always repurchase it if I'm like oh my gosh I really wish I read that book and then I know a lot of people like the second one better than the first one so I'm like do I really need to read this book to read that book and it's just chaos so I don't I don't I'm sorry I'm sorry but I can't do it. <laughs> this one, same. This one, though, like, it's time. This is By Thread by Lucy Score. It's been on numerous TBRs. Um, I've tried time and time again. I just can't do it. I probably, if, like, the audiobook was, like, way cheaper, I probably would get it. And it might be cheap at some point, but it's, like, why force myself? I have plenty of other books that I would much rather read. And then, obviously, this book has been in my cart for probably almost two years now. I don't know, a long time. So, um, I think it's definitely time to let it go. Um, they're just, it's just too long in my opinion. It's just too long. And I'm like, if it was quick, obviously it's very gonna, it's obviously gonna be like very, um, uh, uh, cheesy corny. Um, it says a grumpy boss romantic comedy, like super fun. If it was half this size, I probably would have read it already. But it's like double. And then there are other, I said this, um, in another video, but there are other Lucy Score video, uh, books that, um, I would prefer to read but then I don't buy them because I'm like oh I still have buy a thread that I haven't read and so I'm like I need to just get rid of it you know let it go and then last but certainly not least maybe it is least I don't know <laughs> I do this with a heavy heart it's Miss Checking Mate by Allie Hazelwood I just is one of those things that I just don't want to read I also heard that this is so YA but I think that there are two like open door chapters in here and I just don't need that in my life <laughs> I don't need the YA and I don't need to the combo that's what I'm trying to say I don't need that combo in my life I don't want it I don't need it and then it's like chess like be so 100 no thank you not even one bit of thank yous <laughs> so I don't know I don't know if these are in high school or if they're college I don't know and I have no desire to know is the honest truth and I love Allie Hazelwood which is why I was like so excited it was book of the month I'm like Allie Hazelwood but I'm like I don't need to read every one of, of Allie Hazelwood's books to know that I love her so I'm like I don't need to read her YA so I'm like why do I feel? I felt like I needed to <laughs> and so I'm like now I know so those three books are gonna go to I'm probably gonna try to see if secondhand Charles will take them they usually give you crap for them um, anyway but it's like better to me than like right now I have a bunch of books up on my like pango and like they're not selling at all so <laughs> um, it's like kind of better than them just sitting here forever so at least they can get something even if it's like a dollar freaking they be giving like 50 cents per book but honestly I should like the the 
good thing to do would probably be to just donate them, but like, <laughs> I want to get something, you know what I mean? So, I don't know. Anyway, um, oh, my Kindle and stuff. I'm gonna go grab my Kindle, I'll be right back. I don't know what you guys saw last, but I ended up giving her a little, I changed it a little bit, just because again, I wanted it to be like perfect, and I think this is so cute. I love the little otter, and then just the color scheme was like definitely a vibe. And so I was obsessed, <laughs> and now every time I look at her, I'm like, she's in so hard. Um, I probably, like, could have rearranged it so, like, that gap was where this was, but it's, like, not too much work. It's, like, a, l a little too much work, I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> for, like, something that's not gonna be there for that long. So I was like, oh, perfect. I'm obsessed with it, not gonna lie. But then I also have went crazy on my Kindle. <laughs> so, of course, like, this is, like stickers threw up on it and that stupid middle sticker does not stop moving and I just I'm not gonna take it all off for that one freaking sticker but I thought this was so cute as well I just loved all the little like I love the space that an iPad has um just all like it just makes me smile and obviously it's chaos it's like a uh, bookish throw up but <laughs> it's just like the best so I was obsessed I loved this sticker so much that I was like I need to put it somewhere so it has throne of glass um, it says the Kingdom of Flesh and Fire, but that's, um, well, I can't remember, oh my gosh, From Blood and Ash. And then we have Akatar, and I was like, oh my gosh, <laughs> that trio? Yeah, yeah, that says me all over it. So I loved that, and then, um, Found Family Book Club. Ugh. I just have recently been, like, really loving Found Family. So, all the cute things. So I need to, I wanted to show you guys that. I know the, the glare is, like, annoying, but maybe I'll do a little bit of a close-up later if I feel like it. I don't know. <laughs> um, but I just want to update you. Um, and yeah. I forgot to end this video before I looked like a hot mess. I just worked out, obviously. And so we're going to end this video here. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. It's a quick one. Um, again, we're just hanging, kind of dotting our eyes, crossing our T's, <laughs> like just doing chill stuff. So I thought it was super fun and fresh. You guys can let me know if you kind of like this style of video where it's not too much, very chill. You know the drill. Um, yes, I have a lot of book of videos, good videos planned and reading vlogs planned for, um, August. So if you are not subscribed, definitely hit the subscribe button. Also give this video a thumbs up so that you know that you like it. Um, and yes, I will see you in my next one. Bye nerds.